What's going on YouTube? We're talking serrations today. To serrate or not to serrate? What is your preference? I'm gonna give you my preference. Um, and maybe I'll just start off with what my preference is. Um, eh, I think I'll drag it out a little bit. I've carried both of these and I have a couple examples of each. I have a uh, non-serrated Manicor X. I have a serrated Manicor X. Let's see here, I have a stitch. Which one's this? Stitch Auto with the serration. Doesn't that look toothy? Doesn't that look just like the meanest thing ever? Ugh, like a shark mouth. Anyways, uh, and then the Stitch Auto standard edge and I've carried all these I've used all of them um, uh, I don't know I'll tell you here's maybe what I like about a standard edge will give clues of what I don't like I like a standard edge because it's easy to strop but I'm not a big fan of sharpening stones but I do strop my blades on a fairly regular basis when they're being used and it keeps that edge really sharp i can't do that with a serrated blade um I, I maybe there's some sort of special thing you can buy but all i know is that you, they're hard to sharpen and in order to sharpen them you need to have the special cylindrical uh stones so you can sharpen those serrations and i don't have that in fact i don't have any sharpening kit all I do is strop and my knives stay really sharp. If you get a knife sharp and you keep it sharp, perfect. Um, I, I like how easy a standard edge is to clean. When I wanna cut up, all right, well, what do I cut up? Pizza, berries, some 510 paracord for my son uh, or me, um, cut a stick. I don't know to me all those things a standard edge just fine and and these serrations they they can gum up with stuff and I don't really like that I don't know I know that the serrated edge feels much sharper I mean if you're to rub your hand across very lightly across this thing and I, don't do this I shouldn't even suggest it but then rub it across there. Those are like little teeth. And not only is it a sharp edge, but they've got like sharp little teeth and they will cut in a lot better. Um, so you do get a little more cutting surface and you get those sharpened teeth, but I don't need those. I don't know that I've ever needed serrations to do anything. Um, they're just not for me. They're not, that's it in a nutshell. Serrations are not for me. They don't add anything to a knife that I need more than just a really sharp standard edge blade. This does what I need to. I like, you know, the smoothness. I, I feel like, let me give you an example. When I cut my kid's pizza, you know, sometimes I'll just press down like this as I'm going along. And this, with the teeth protruding down, I don't feel like you get it all the way. You really have to like s s use the saw in order to get it cut smooth. So there it is. I'm not a fan of serrations. Uh, I love these standard edges and I bought this one because it was the only one available, was partially serrated. If it would have been fully serrated, I would have never done it. Um, but when, then when this one came along, I should probably sell this one, but this one with, uh, these both have G10 handles and this has a little more texture. That's a different video. We're talking about serrations. Standard edge, thumbs up. Serrated, wah, wah, wah. thumbs down as far as I'm concerned. Thanks YouTube. Have an amazing day. If you like what you see, subscribe. Maybe uh, give me a like, leave a comment. Tell me why you like serrations. That's what I want to know. Tell me what I'm missing. Thanks.